you're just a wonderful audience. I'm so glad I came. Um, thank you for being readers. I just want to close by saying, and if you have to, if you have like a babysitter or something, if you got to go, that's fine. I'm I'm just winding up here. Uh, I'm going to thank you for reading fiction. There's so many things you can be doing with your time, and I know that. And there is some part of us that feels like we should be taking in real information because there is so much of that that we need to do. And I'm just here to say novels are true also. There are different ways we perceive truth. We perceive facts, and we also perceive truths with our hearts. And I think that's, I mean, because of the way we evolved and the, because we, you know, we spent most of, our, most of our evolutionary time was spent just getting information from each other, from people. And a novel is the next best thing. The, a novel, unlike, unlike, you know, the news or a newspaper or anything like that. A novel actually puts you inside of another human brain. Nothing else does that. So when you go inside of another person for the duration of a novel and you, their children become your children and they are, their problems are your problems and you feel what that life is like, you come out of it a better human. That's what we need is compassion empathy. That's the antidote. That's what will save us. So thank you.